ओम शांति वेलकम टू ट्वेंटी एथ ऑफ नवम्बर्स गॉड यू ब्लेसिंग हैविंग अ माइंड एंड आर वर्ड्स मैचिंग विद ईच अदर इट हैज एन इम्पैक्ट ऑन द वर्ल्ड इट हैज एन इम्पैक्ट इन एवरीथिंग विच वी ट्राई टू थिंक एंड डू वेर एज अ पर्सन हु फील्स समथिंग एल्स फ्रॉम इन साइड एंड से इज द राइट थिंग्स बट डजेंट फील द राइट थिंग फ्रॉम इन साइड इज इन कंफ्लिक्ट विद इन एंड दैट कंफ्लिक्ट इज गोइंग टू शो इन द वर्ल्ड टू so supreme father says may you become an embodiment of easy success by doing powerful service with your mind while also serving with words first is mind then is the words so people generally say think and speak now think this is this is think and speak but you can think evil you can think impure you can think pure you can think pious thoughts which are going to have more effect yes you're right pious thoughts pure thoughts with the pure words are going to be more impactful because other souls are not fools they are not dumb people or dumb souls who will just take your word for the truth because they also want to see what you actually intend to do and for that they have to be very conscious and cautious about what feelings and what vibrations you are letting out that's what people are moving towards to they are moving towards more consciousness So God says, just as you have become experienced in being constantly busy in serving with words, that's what we have been doing. Similarly, at every moment, together with serving with words, let there also automatically be service taking place with your thoughts. Serving with the mind means that you and others automatically feel the pure vibrations of having good wishes. Who? First, I have to feel, and then the other person will automatically feel. If I have got pure feelings towards somebody and I am saying some pure words through my mouth, then automatically that person is going to believe in me. But if I have got something else in my mind, I have got ill feelings in my mind, but I am trying to be very sweet in front of them, the facial expressions will make the other person feel awkward, and that itself means that that person will not be able to trust you or believe you. So God says first, clear the inside, program your mind clearly, purify it. and with good wishes and pure feelings at every moment for every soul and then is going to work let there constantly be blessings emerging from your mind for all souls at every moment by serving with your mind the energy of your words will be saved and this powerful service with your mind will easily make you an embodiment of success by serving with your mind the energy of your words will be saved that means you don't have to give an explanation so many times people generally complain that i I have to explain to my husband or my wife so many times. I have to sometimes shout. I have to sometimes be bossy. I have to sometimes manipulate and get the work done. They don't understand me, and the main reason behind that is our feelings towards them. Because when we say things out of hatred or when we say things out of oh, this person is never going to think do the thing which I say, but let me say it, then it doesn't work because that's the old way. and god says try the new way and to learn the new way to come over to brahma kumari center and understand how to first cleanse and clean the mind so that we have the energy to even give out good feelings and good wishes to others and that comes from god by meditating on him om shanti with us